Hey guys, what's up? It's me again, and today I have a little unboxing video for you to. And it just came in the mail today, and it says from Tempting Toys and Collectibles, so I have a feeling I know what it is, so let's get this mother unwrapped. My little friend, Mr. Green Scissors. Okay, cut this tape. Come on, come on, come on. And I have a really good feeling I know what it is. Like, just get this tape out of here. I need to invest in a box cutter. Wait, what's this thing here? Okay, that is just a weird box. I must have to do it something or He-Man or something. But, uh... Hold on, let me... Get that. Well, at least I tipped it good. Some Japanese newspaper in here, and here it is. Yeah. Didn't it take me that long to get it out of the box. Hey, but now it's stuck in this. So, oh, let me get its tag off. So, you guys want to see what it is? Okay, cue the music. It is the 1955 Godzilla. To be more specific, the Frozen version. And all I can say is, about time he arrives. This figure is actually pretty tall, you know? I mean, at least they didn't do, make the same mistake they did for the regular version of this guy, which is the actual skin. The sails right here are going upwards the way they should. Instead, on the regular figure, they're reversed, which looks stupid. But anyways, I'm glad I got this guy. He's still a deluxe figure to me. I mean, I can see why, but here's the card it came with, see, Godzilla 1955, and by the way, that does say Godzilla in Japanese, I can sort of read that stuff, so yeah, he's finally here, 1955 Godzilla, and I will get around to reviewing him later, but uh, I will see you guys later.